Hi guys, today we're going to learn a bit of code. But before we do that, if you didn't watch my video on how to sign up for REPL.IT, you should go watch that before you watch this video because you'll need to know how to sign up for REPL.IT. So yeah, we'll just get started. So imagine you wanted to know the answer for 5 times 6. Okay, let's print that. I mean, let's write that code. 5 times 6, run it, and it does nothing. The reason is, Python knows what to do with this code, but it doesn't know that you are wanting it to, like, print it on the console. So, what you want to do to make it know that you want to print it on the console, the, to, to print the answer on the console, you have to do print, all lowercase, Parenthesis and then parenthesis around the equation. This is the equation. So then, yeah, when you run that, you get the answer as 30. Because now it knows to print the answer on the console. So it did that. So now what you're going to do, now imagine, now we're going to learn something else about print. It's called a string. A string can be used with double quotes or single quotes. I like to use single quotes because you just have to type a one button. But if you use double quotes, you have to type two buttons. Shift and then the symbol. Single quote button. But I want to like do all the code fast, so I just use a single quote as my string. Most of the time. And then uh, you wanted to print hello world. World. And explana explanation mark. It just prints hello world because you told it to. As you can see. But if you take out the string, then if you run it, it will be an error. Because hello world isn't an equation or anything else like that. So here's an example. If your friend was giving you a note and it says, do this e uh, equation. And then it said, hello, comma, space, world, exclamation mark. That's not an equation. So you won't know what to do. So what do you do with that? Nobody knows. So... You just throw it in the track hand, probably, if that was what you would do. So, if you wanted to know what to do with that, you have to put a string. Uh, not right there. You have to put a string. And if you put a string, like the thing inside the parentheses where the string ended should be read. So, yeah, and then if you run that, it'll print a little world, as you saw before. But now, let's learn another thing about print. So, imagine that you wanted to know, like, write all of the equation. I mean, print all the equation, which is 5 times 6 equals 30. Well, you can do that in two ways. Using the string, 5 times 6. 6 equals 30, that'll just print that. But if you don't want to, like, do that, then you can also use this code and then go out of the string space plus space str parentheses 5 times 6 with no space. And then if you run it, you get... 5 times 6 equals 30. Run it. You get 5 times 6 equals 30. So yeah, that was it for today. Bye. See you, see you in my next video about uh, uh, variables.